Hello, Pisces. How are you? Pisces, I've got to tell you, I was so excited to do your video. I don't know why. It's bizarre. Um, I have a feeling that people, you may be seeing people that you haven't seen in a while, and they missed you, and they're happy to see you. Um, yeah, I don't know. Also, I kept thinking that as soon as I get to Pisces, I get to rearrange my body so I am more comfortable. I think, Pisces, that you're becoming more comfortable in your skin. Oisin, thoughts, King Arthur, Dragon Rider. Interesting. Hold on. Connected with the divine. Your thoughts are connected with the divine. And you are taking hard control for victory. I was shuffling these. This came out. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it because of the lighting. It's a six of Gabrielle. Congratulations. You've done a wonderful job. Time to move on to the next project. Award scholarships or promotions. Congratulations, Pisces. You have done a wonderful drop, a wonderful job, and you are thinking about your next adventure. Pisces, you are thinking about your next adventure here. Taking control, riding the beast, riding the dragon, being divinely guided with your thoughts. You're making sure that your thoughts are under control, that your thoughts are creating your future. You are manifesting. Queen of Gabrielle, King of Michael, Ten of Michael, Seven of Michael. Pisces, why do you think you have to do everything alone? Why do you think that you don't need assistance? Let me, let me, let me, okay, side note here, Pisces. When you think that you don't need assistance with things, maybe you don't. However, have you ever given thought to the fact that by doing this, you are alienating those that you love, those that are happy to see you, those that appreciate you? Think about that. Under Oisin, protection. Queen of Gabrielle, you can do anything right now. Go after what you want, the ability to attract helpful people oh my under thoughts king of michael wisdom and objectivity are important now stay in your integrity the situate a situation that calls for honest and open communication that's with yourself as well under K king arthur the king of the dragons a situation has ended and you are finally free New opportunities for happiness will now follow. Put the past behind you. And I think you're doing exactly that, love. Okay, Dragon Rider, Seven of Michael. There is a better course of action available to you. Working alone may not be the best answer. Review all the details. Like I said, you're not trusting right now. So you're more focused on doing this alone. I'm telling you, Pisces, don't do that. Okay? Think about including others, even if it's smaller tasks. Okay? So as not to, you know, get in the way of your independence and all. Death. Excellent. You might be dealing with Scorpio. Seven of Wands. Ten of Swords on the Ten of Swords. Holy crap. Strength. Wow. Two of Wands, Queen of Cups, Five of Wands, Tower, Fool, Ace of Cups, King of Swords. Again with the King of Swords. you got the Ten of Swords and the King of Swords. Twice. All right, let's take a look here. Scorpio is heavily indicated, as is Aries. And Leo's over here. J 
just saying. Death, seven of wands, ten of swords, strength. You are making a huge, major transformation. You can do anything right now. You are making a huge transformation because you know that you, you're capable. Yeah, we know you're capable, Pisces. You're releasing the past. These swords are not in him. They're being pulled out. So you're being released. Ten of Michael, ten of swords, same card. Strength. You have the ability. You have the perseverance. You have the wherewithal to continue on your journey. However, there is a better course of action. Working alone may not be the best answer, okay? This change and transformation, knowing that you're capable of doing this, is leading you to a new beginning. Two of Wands. There's a stag standing in his way. All it is is a stag. He just has to shoo it out of his way. Don't worry about rough beginnings, about bumps in the road, about having to move obstacles out of your way. It's going to be easier than what you think, okay? Queen of Cups, Seven of Wands, Ten of Swords, Queen of Cups. You're getting in touch with your emotions because there's a new emotion being birthed. She's pregnant. There's no way anybody can tell me she's not pregnant. You can't see it. She's pregnant. She's pregnant. Just know she's pregnant, Okay. A new emotional state is being birthed. Five of Swords. You don't know what to think about this because of the past. Tower. Because you're taking the new journey, you get a tower moment. Because you do want this a new emotional state more than the conflict about it, you get the Fool card. And the Ace of Cups. Oh my God. But here you are, being stoic, right? King of Swords, being all kinds of stoic, going, do I trust it? Do I trust it? Yes, Pisces, I'm telling you, yes. The Chariot, yes, absolutely. absolutely. friggin lutely Look at that, the Chariot card. Trust it. Trust the new beginning. Trust the new emotional happiness. Trust that things are working out for you. Okay, let's gather these up. Pisces, allow yourself to receive love. Allow yourself to be happy. Take down some of those walls. All I'm saying. All right, let's get a card of advice from the dreams of Gaia and then... You already had your card flip from um, the Sacred Rebel. So we will do that one also. I do go live on Sundays, 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. I do all 12 signs and free readings. Also, if you're interested in a personal reading, email me. Pisces. Advice for Pisces for the week of October 17th, please. Integrity, number 23, Major Arcana. And I will show you if it bothers to show up. Intuition. Integrity. Uh, you can kind of see it. Integrity. Integrity, honesty, honor, character. Values, morality, sincerity, consistency, principles, and fairness. Act with honesty and honor. Walk your talk. Everyone deserves a second chance. Oppose hypocrisy, dishonesty, cruelty, and injustice. Practice ethical and honest behavior. Do not play favorites. Be the best person you can be. Do it for love, not for profit. Keep your promises. Do not betray a trust. Avoid gossip and speaking ill of others. Do not cheat or take the easy way. Do not allow injustice or cruelty towards innocence. 
behavior and actions influence reputation. We all live in glass houses, so avoid judging. Just staying in your integrity, Pisces, all right? And then number 27 of the Sacred Rebels. seven Pisces you're coming into a new place within yourself and it's a very comfortable place I'm getting wow your reading is fast receiving you are so loved your every need is witnessed and responded to by the universe however you sometimes forget this. You become swept up in the monumental, oh, I'm sorry, in the momentum of habitual consciousness and you forget to take a moment to stop, breathe in, and be. In that moment, you can receive the love of the universe that is receiving you. It will nourish you with contentment and energy. You have not done this enough. So your soul is becoming parched and is drying out. Energy has been going out of you, but there's not enough coming back in. It is time to bring something back in for you to receive and be received. You are being offered a chance for restoration now to feel nourished, cared for, and loved. Accept it. You deserve it. We're going to go for, we're going to skip ahead to the healing process. Like I said, let others take care of you. Let others love you. Okay, Pisces? Say this aloud. I'm going to, I'm going to say it and I'll give pauses where you can repeat what I say. It's always suggested that you say it a total of three times. So you can drag that little dot back on the bottom of the screen. I release all false guilt and shame about having needs and all false beliefs about rest being wasteful or unnecessary. I accept healthy, productive, sacred rest and the gifts of happiness that it brings. I understand that rest and activity, balance, feed and nourish each other. There is sacred healing that happens through rest, which is very powerful. I accept and receive this now through unconditional love. This is now so. Okay, Pisces, that's all I have for you now. For now, I hope to see you soon. You know I love you. Peace to you. Ciao.